One of the noteworthy features in the SkyView system is how configurable the engine monitoring system or EMS page can be. The ability to locate the sensor information and how it is displayed is a powerful and flexible tool within the SkyView system. But did you know there is a feature within the page layout editor that can help the pilot differentiate information within the page? The SkyView system can accommodate two horizontal and two vertical dividing lines within any of the EMS page layouts. Adding this divider line can alter the way the sensor or flight information is presented to the pilot, clarifying the presentation on the EMS screen. To add or edit a divider line, go into the Setup menu using buttons 7 and 8, then rotate the knob to highlight EMS Setup and push the knob. Once again, rotate the knob to highlight Screen Layout Editor and push to select. Scroll to choose the page you wish to edit and again push to select. Now push button 4, Info or Information. As before, use the knob to scroll down to highlight a horizontal or vertical divider. Note if there is an asterisk next to the title. This indicates the item is already active on the page and you will be editing that item, not adding. When the divider you wish to add is highlighted, select Accept. The divider line will now appear close to the center of the screen and you can now edit the location using the right knob for up or down position and the left knob for right to left position. You can also select the size or length of the line by selecting size. It is perfectly acceptable if the divider line goes beyond the viewable area of the page. The part of that line outside the area simply won't appear when viewed on the EMS page. Once you are done editing, select Save, then Exit. It's worth mentioning here that adding a divider line within the 50% page does not automatically add it to any of the other pages. Those must be edited individually. The divider line will now appear on the edited EMS page, providing better clarification of information on that page. Thanks for watching. For more quick tip videos, be sure to visit the Dynon YouTube channel. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button now and be sure to like and share these quick tip videos.